Okay, guys, so I'm not doing this live on Facebook. Um, I'm going to upload it to YouTube because, yeah, my phone, like, I don't have that many gigs of data left, and I'm already in trouble for running a phone bill. <laughs> so, um, I was going to walk a little bit while it's daytime because, you know, last night, me and my husband decided we were going to go out and kind of play at the creepy courthouse here. My friend Loney, waving. Um, took you on a little tour about Jackson Port Van Haunted. There was a lot of places like my signal went out. So, maybe doing it like this, we'll get a little more in there um tonight since i'm doing it this way i might talk him into actually going to the whole hanging tree i know he's been watching this guy on youtube with his family called oh my gosh and they did 3 a.m challenges where they got a haunted places at 3 a.m you know the witching hour and they decided to mess around see if they can find anything so he said something about wanting to do one of those I'm just not sure about where we're at. Um, I'll, instead of looking at me, I'll switch it around. Give you all a little something to look at. So you'll know exactly kind of like where I'm at. If I can do that on here. Shoot. I guess it's not going to work. Okay, we'll do this. Alright, that right there. That's my dog's girlfriend. Yeah. Ivan. That's his little live girlfriend in the ditch. Um, I'll do it this way. And people are probably going to look at me stupid for talking to the phone. Because they probably think I'm talking to myself. But this is kind of what it looks like in the daytime. Come on, Coco. Come on. Get out of that ditch. <clears throat> You're going to get bit by a snake. Alright. This is Jackson Port in the daytime. It's actually nice and pretty out here. We just had a storm come through early today. So, we're gonna walk down here. She's still following me. She's pregnant. I don't know which one got her. Um, if it's my dog and my neighbor's cool with it, you know, somebody might get puppies. They'll be pit and lab mix, but I think they'll be cute. And she's a good tempered dog. You still coming? Come on. Alright, that's what it looks like in the daytime. On which I had started recording as I got to the end of my road. If you can't tell how small this place is. I think there's like, the sign says 273, but I really don't think that's right. Honestly, because there's been so many people move in and out. It's kind of odd. Oh, Jesus. Alright, we're coming up on the little snow cones. It's um, a snow cone stand, bait and tackle. They have barbecue, hamburgers, all that stuff. I'll show you what it looks like. It's really good. We normally eat there a lot during the summer. Um, we usually, yeah. His kids come down here and get snow cones and food. I mean, that's pretty much where everybody chills at. If we don't want to drive like four miles in a town. So, I live out here in Jacksonport. In Arkansas. Um, that direction. Well, hold on. That direction, once you get on the highway, is Newport. Hey. We're like um, three or four miles outside of town. So we got to drive out there for like gas and groceries and all that good stuff. Because obviously there's not going to be a grocery store out here. There used to be a gas station out here a long time ago. Um, let's see, what else? If you drive the opposite direction, you're 30 minutes from Batesville. 
which is bigger than Newport. But the South Island State, we're probably about 40, 45 minutes interstate-wise from Jonesboro. But it's a quiet little town. Um, nobody really does anything. Everybody knows everybody or everybody's kin to everybody. One of those type things. And we're almost to the courthouse. Coco's still with me. My little guard doggy. She don't run off. So the doggies are working. Um, TJ couldn't be here with me, which is kind of funny. Um, I got bored sitting at the house. He actually fell asleep on the couch. Uh, <laughs> I woke him up and I was like, hey, I'm gone for a walk. And taught him where I'd be at. If he decided to get up and come down here. He's been napping on and off all day. I think the icky weather's been making all of us sleepy. But, there's the courthouse, as promised. Showing y'all during the day. Um, I don't know what time it closes to go in. Like I said, since I've lived here, I've only been in it once, which is odd. I should know these things. I've lived here for like five years. And I've lived in this county on and off my entire life. I still don't know what time. Might be able to stop at the ranger station though and ask. And see what's going on there. I really wish I'd let somebody come in and do a sit-in. But you'd have to talk to the park right, the guy over the park about that. And then he'd have to go through the city board. So that's a lot of craziness. Where the heck did that dog go? Go, go! I don't want him to, well, hire us to get run over. I don't know why I keep calling it again. I don't know. I think she took off without me. Um, all right, I'll flip my phone in a second once we get up here. Where's this dog? Anyway, she'll, she'll find her way. She'll find me. All right.